This HAN Network video is brought to you by Walter Stewart's Market. On the campus of Darien High School, this is the HAN Network's 2016 Winter Sports Tour. I'm Frank Ernino, and I'm joined now by the Blue Wave captains for the boys' squash team. They are Will Granith, Harrison Gill, and Walker Wynn. Gentlemen, thank you for taking time with us today. Will, let me start with you. Being named a captain, what did that mean uh, coming into your senior year? Uh, you know, I, uh, I'd previously been on JV for three years, so it was a huge goal of mine to make varsity my senior year. Uh, I worked all summer, um, and being named a captain was pretty special to me. You know, it was culmination of like six years of, of hard work. Now, Harrison, not a lot of our viewers are that familiar with squash. You guys don't play in the FC FCAC. Why don't you tell us a little more about the league you're in? So we play in the Fair West League, which is actually a combination of both Fairfield teams and Westchester, just because, um, because it's a more obscure sport. Uh, they have to field teams from a greater region, but we still get to play teams such as Rye, Greenwich, and then New Canaan we have on our schedule and a couple more. So It's good to hear the rivalry lives on in the sports. Will, uh, excuse me, uh, Walker, you guys were champions of the league last year. What did that accomplishment feel like? Uh, yeah, um, so we ended up being undefeated in the Fair West, and um, it felt really good because in past years we've had uh, greater rivalries with New Canaan and more contention, and last year our everything just came together, and we had a great team, and at the end of the season we were able to uh, hold the trophy above our heads, and it felt great. Now, Will, you guys lose a couple of seniors from last year's roster, but expectations are just as high. How are the how does the team feel right now as you get closer and closer to the start of the year? Yeah, we uh, we lost two seniors on our starting rotation, but uh, we've had we have a lot of good um, juniors, and we have one very good freshman, Henry Sparkman. Um, so the juniors have really been stepping up their game. They're taking the number two and three spots. So they've been uh, they've been helping to carry us in the wake of the lost seniors. Harrison, you guys were the best national public, the best public school team in the nation last year. You competed at nationals. What was that experience like for the Wave? Well, nationals is always a really great experience for us. It was um, kind of our Super Bowl of the year. We played a uh, Division Two last year, and we faced off against both boarding private schools and also public schools, and we went undefeated in that tournament, uh, clinching the the second division, which was definitely the biggest moment of. Uh, the season it was fantastic. As you guys get set for this season now, what are the expectations and goals? How, what do you hope to accomplish with this group? Yeah, so our goals this season, um, hopefully we can repeat our last season, win Division II. Um, it's it's going to be pretty difficult seeing as we lost two key seniors, but um, we really hope to do really well in Nationals, and um, it seems like a pretty good goal to uh, be the champions of Fair West again. Well, finish this sentence for me. Darianne wins the Fair West Division if they do what? Uh, <laughs> if we just keep playing like we've been playing all year. You know, we, um, we've all been practicing hard in the off season, And um, honestly, we're not, we're not that much worse than last year. You know, we, I think we can go undefeated again and, and take home the ship. Harrison, last question here. If there's one match that people should keep an eye out for for Darianne Squash, which one would that be? I'd say the interesting one, we always uh, have good matches, first of all against New Canaan just because it's the rivalry, but um, I think the most competitive one, hopefully we can make the Brunswick match competitive. Uh, they've got an extremely strong team, but we hope that we can uh, get up there on their turf at their facility and uh, really show them uh, what a public school can do. Well, boys, thank you so much for taking time with us. Best of luck this year. We can't wait to see hey, what you're going to do. From the HAN Network, this is Frank Renito for the 2016 Winter Sports Tour. Stay tuned as we continue to roll on through the rest of the conference.